is Dr. Anna Marie Diaz. I'm a general practitioner currently working in Universal Hospital. Today, I'm going to talk about vitamin D deficiencies, its symptoms, its causes, and ways to prevent and treat this condition. Low vitamin D levels or vitamin D deficiency is one of the major public health concerns, especially here in the Middle East. It affects uh, people of all ages, from neonates, pregnant women, young children, even men, and most of the causes, the most common causes will be lack of exposure to sunlight and sometimes malabsorption. In children, the usual cause is that prolonged breastfeeding. Breastfeeding, um, breast milk has little vitamin D and for children, they usually need supplementation with vitamin D. Among the symptoms of vitamin D deficiency would be pain in the muscles, pain in the bones, and in the long term, if it's not corrected, it could result in brittle bones and misshapen bones, bones that are oddly shaped. Um, for children, uh, it could cause rickets. And the symptoms of rickets would be uh, delayed onset of walking or bowed legs. Despite ample amount of sunshine in the Middle Eastern countries, most people still have vitamin D deficiencies because of many factors. Some would in include uh, some factors would include culture preferences, such as the clothing style of women, which prevents adequate sunlight absorption by the skin. And some would be because of lack of uh, dietary sources, and some even some with dark skin coloration. Um, prevents the adequate absorption of uh, vitamin D into the body. Now, most diet dietary sources uh, of foods rich in vitamin D are inadequate for our daily needs of vitamin D. Um, these foods include oily fish, such as salmon, mackerel, um, blue fish, and dairy products, such as milk and eggs. Now, if you're experiencing symptoms of vitamin D deficiency, such as muscle pains and muscle aches and back pains and bone pains, it is highly advised that you go to your general physician to have your vitamin D levels checked, especially if you live here in the in Gulf countries. Um, if sunlight, adequate sunlight exposure is not possible because sometimes the summers and the temperatures in the Middle Eastern countries can be too harsh for sunlight exposure or if uh, dietary intake adequate dietary intake is not possible, then a general physician can very well advise you to take vitamin D supplements to help make your vitamin D levels within the normal limits. I would like to thank everyone for taking time to listen to my short lecture. Uh, I wish everyone good health and thank you again.